If anything goes wrong, you won't be able to come back. I won't be, Doc. It's been a year and it's really hard living like this. This much of a dosage will put you in a shock, which is exactly what we want. But it might even kill you. My best advice: try not to die. Shock and death. Some might say I am way past that in reality. Some. Twenty years of my life. and i don't remember even a second of it <laughs> car crashes can be so deceiving even if they don't kill you they end up taking your life away from you even after recovery a human's fragility remains in the mind i never suggest anyone to meddle with it but you i do want to help you you're awfully interested in me doc What do you feel? What do you feel when you wake up? When you go back to bed? Seconds passing by. Clock constantly ticking. Not for me. Not for me. I feel like I feel like I'm frozen in time. But that's why I'm here. That's why I come here. Tired of feeling trapped and lost all at the same time. There's nothing but misery all around me. Just remember, once we enter a mind palace, We be on our own separate paths. Five minutes on the clock, nothing more. We'll be all alone in there. It's a fact that it's your own mind palace, but you'll have no memory of its existence. My job: finding each and every piece of you in there as soon as possible, and safely extracting you, along with your memories, back to your conscious self. Five minutes. Is that all it would take? Enough for me to look around. Don't go too deep. Your mind is broken, which makes it a very dangerous place for you. As long as you are aware of your existence, you'll be alive. Otherwise, there's no coming back. So, is this what's really going to happen? This is not a magic trick. I'm just thinking up in the brain. Does that even make sense? Let's have a chit chat. Shall we begin? Yes. All right. Keep breathing and focus on my voice. Can you hear me? Yes. What's happening? Where am I? You're falling. This is your mind, bottomless pit, a well leading directly to your memories. I can see it. Your palace. Such detailed construction. Your childhood home. The place you spend the majority of your life in. 
Soon it was. Time was short. But I wonder, what is the clock inside? Inside all these doors. I've never seen anything like this before. Jumble is what it looks like. A part of you experiencing beginning and end all at the same time. You're losing your conscience by the minute. Everything falls apart the moment these dominoes are down. The accident. Cause it your effect. A rift in the brain. Lead it to its collapse. So poetic. Sinking in your own mind. You seem injured. I can hear the cry for help. The atmosphere. It's so calming to me. But I reckon you feel alienated. You're not alone. Not anymore. Looking at your own construction, your glass chamber, something so close, yet out of reach. You're confined by your own memories. Let me guide you to the exit. This is where the rubber meets the road. The depiction of a fragile mind. Not bad. It's time to come down. The light is reaching you. How are you still falling? That was in the last one calling for help. Can you hear me? What's happening? I feed everyone, didn't I? I went to every room. Then, then why can't you hear me? Why aren't you responding? Where are you? Everything went according to the plan. Then. Frozen in time. That's what you said. I missed the most important one. Palace. It tricked me. I was so run by it. Almost hypnotized. That's why it was all so calming to me. So calming that it stopped me before I could unravel anymore. This palace has less deeper than I expected. Time. Was never enough. It's over. It's all over. Was I ever even in control? This curiosity, it took the better of me. Should I just leave? Leave all of this off? Increasing my dosage could turn extremely lethal. It's all even worth it. All I have to do is all I will ever do. All right.
you wake up, don't forget to close the door when you leave. Our chaos is greater than you. It's time to rectify yours. Wake up. So, it does have a bottom. Do you know what it's like to reverse the flow of time? You will. Wake up. I can't tell you what happens from this point. It will all be a blur when you wake up. My advice. Don't look for any answers. You won't find any out there. There are still many doors to open. Many more corridors to explore. It's time to act upon my curiosity. Uncover what's concealed. Our minds, our minds are deep and vivid. Sadly, reality is not. Whatever we experience, it's always out there. We just need to know where to look for them.